Hi everyone! Today I am going to be doing an unboxing and review of this new countertop ice maker. So I'm super excited about this ice maker. Um, it is perfect for summer that's coming up to have extra ice for any kind of party, for a boat, um, for just for your house to have extra ice, um, making smoothies all summer long, having nice cold drinks. It's a really great idea. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the box and take a look at what's inside. All right, so all I did was just take out the styrofoam from the box. It was just in some uh, nicely packaged styrofoam, kept it really safe. Um, and also there was an instruction manual inside the box. So right on top, you had the instructions, high capacity ice maker um, with all the information about how to use it and how to put it together. So you can see in the picture, there's the water tray, the evaporator, ice basket, water tank, just a little bit about how it works. It does come with a nice plastic shovel that'll make it easy to scoop the ice and a little bit about the control panel so this ice maker does have a self-cleaning option so all you need to do is press that button and it's going to clean itself out which makes it really really easy to use it will tell you when the ice is full it'll tell you when you need to add water that's one thing i love about this you don't need to plumb it into your house you can just simply add water which makes it really portable and super easy to set up um, it has a different select button. You can choose between small ice or large ice cubes. So it's gonna make the small ice really, really quickly. Actually in six to seven minutes, you should have nine perfect small ice cubes. Um, it just has a little bit of troubleshooting, some cleaning and usage guides, how to clean it, how to add the water, um, and if you have any problems. So it looks like a helpful manual there. So I'm gonna go ahead and unwrap this. silver model. Um, it's taped shut, so we're just going to tape that off. And it has all the buttons that you need right here. So this one is a push button, and these are just going to light up when um, the machine is in use. So there's the power, and then the select, so you can select between the different cube sizes. It'll tell you when it's full, when it's defrosting, um, when it needs water right up top there. And it does also have a fan that'll go on. So the fan will actually help um, keep the ice machine cold and make your ice last a little bit longer. So that's a really great feature as well. So now we'll look inside. So inside here is the little ice scoop. So it's a cute little plastic scoop. You do always want to use plastic when using um, ice if you're scooping in because if any glass happened to break, you wouldn't be able to see it. So you really wanna make sure you have plastic. And it also has this little storage basket for the ice to fall into. Um, so it's nice and convenient. As you can see, it has a uh, max fill line. One second, let me back that up. You can see it says the fill line right here. It says max, it's a little bit hard to see. And all the way in the back here is where the ice is gonna be made. So on these little, um, metal posts those get really really cold so the ice is gonna or the water is gonna drip down and then freeze around those little tubes so that is what makes the bullet ice so this makes bullet ice which has like a cube with a hole in the center and the hole is just from the ice being made on these little posts right here so i'm going to go ahead and take off this tape back here um was once the ice is made this little piece right here will move forward and kind of shovel the ice into the front where it's going to be stored. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this up on my counter, add some water, show you how that's all done and start the ice machine right up. Okay, so I have the ice maker on my countertop and first thing I'm gonna do is just go ahead and remove the uh, little basket and scoop. And then I'm gonna fill the water into the reservoir. So this is the reservoir of the ice machine. Um, and the ice is actually gonna fall right on top of it. So there's a line right there, and that is the line you don't wanna exceed. So you're just gonna fill it with water. Don't exceed the max line. Just start off with about half. Um, this ice maker is also going to make up to 26 pounds of ice in 24 hours, but it starts making nine little cubes in just seven minutes, which is what we're gonna watch now. So I put the ice bucket basket back in, the water's right under it, and there is the inside again. And I'm gonna go ahead and press power. So it automatically just turns on. So you can see 
in the back, it's getting ready to make the ice. So this is all automatic. This machine is just going by itself. So I am also just going to set the cubes. They automatically get set to large, but you can set them to small as well, and that'll make the cubes faster. So again, there it is, just kind of doing its thing. You hear the water just turned on. So it sounds like it is filling up the ice tray. You can see the water kind of dripping in the back. You can get a peek. There's just water dripping into the tray. Like it's getting ready to freeze. All right, so exactly seven minutes later, I heard the ice dump. As you can also hear, you can hear the fan is on and it's pretty quiet. So it's not a really loud machine, um, but I did hear the ice fall into the basket. So seven minutes later, there's perfect little ice cubes and it already has filled itself back up and is making more in the back there. So ice cubes, as you can see, this is the large ice cube setting and it has that hole in the middle. So it's a pretty good sized cube and um, it's perfect for any kind of mixed drinks because the drink is going to go right into that hole and it's going to chill really fast. So I'm going to go ahead and let this uh, fill up some more and then make some drinks. Oh, also, if you wanted to transport the ice, you can easily just lift it out of the basket, and bring the ice wherever you want. This is a pretty amazing machine. Okay, so I've had the ice machine plugged in for about 45 minutes now, and it has been over here just making ice. As you can see, the basket is almost full. It has these perfect bullet cubes, um, and it is still running, and making a lot. So I already have quite a few for lots of drinks. Those bullet ice cubes are perfect for cooling down your drinks quickly. They're great for crunching. They're perfect for smoothies. A blender could chop those up right away. Um, the countertop design is really nice and easy. All you had to do is pour in water and it started making ice right away. It's compact so it could live on your counter permanently. It would be great for if you had a boat or just to put outside at a party for guests to scoop their own ice and it works pretty much instantly. So all you have to do is plug it in, turn it on, press the power button, and it starts making ice immediately. I hope you guys found this video helpful and I would definitely recommend getting a countertop ice maker if you have some ice needs, if you're getting ready for summer, getting ready for parties. It is a perfect little machine to have. Thanks.